another guy I wanted to be in the front. Uh, Yeah, I've had really lots of bad guys. This guy, he is like deceptively good, but he has the insecure trait, so he's like minus 10% compared to the rest. Hmm. Okay, so if this guy is ever going to tank, he needs more resolve. Maybe, like, he's just not good enough, so maybe we just ignore range defense or go for more health. I saw this dude says two melee defense or reported. <laughs> Unfollowed, unsub. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but the two melee defense is basically always good. Like this is the strongest stat in the game, I think. Um, the one thing that worries me is like this will be like uh, our arrow magnet. Like he's just gonna, he's gonna be hit a lot. So. Uh, yeah, I'm playing with the. Um, I'm playing with the um, random uh, crisis. So if we get the noble war, this guy's like he's gonna be trashed by the. Arbalesters. Yeah. <laughs> the arbalesters. Okay, so he's mainly tank. He's mainly tanky. So we'll just. Get the rotate so we can save brothers. Okay, we have a level up again. Like two fatigue every fucking single time. Like I want this guy to be a two-hander, but he's really, really bad on the fatigue. Um, I'm gonna do it anyway. So now we have a few days to go search for um, for that famed item. So, let's get on to it. Ah, what do you know? Free experience. So what are you saying about the dots? Dum, dum, dum. Well, basically, dots is my least favorite skill. I think it's pure bad. I will try and have a run where I go all out initiative and dots. But as of now, I think it's just really bad. So what's happening here is they think they have the range advantage. Uh, we can do like this, swap around, they will come towards us next round, maybe they will anyway. Let's just do like this. Then we swap back next round. It's always easier to have them engage than you engaging. Yeah, Terminator said that um, he has an idea on how to fix dodge, and I agree. Sounds really good. Drastically reduce initial initiative, but make it unaffected by build-up fatigue, only worn armor. And then you just have to do some testing to balance the actual numbers. 
I think that's really a good suggestion. Because right now, as Dodge stands, it's... I don't know. When would you ever pick initiative over melee defense, for example? Just... Hmm. Someone mentioned yesterday on the stream that bad thing about dodge is that you get a max roll on initiative of six and you have a 15% chance to get that maximum roll on initiative. And what it does is a max roll of six gives you only 0 0.9 on melee defense and range defense. Yeah, In but it also game. gets you the first move, which is a lot uh, as well. Yeah. Like, In, don't, don't underestimate situation. having the first move. Come on. Okay, so he's uh, basically without head armor. Um, here. Pop. Let's see if we can pop this guy. Yeah, so yesterday someone was saying, oh, why do we have so many maces? Usually I have three, maybe four in the beginning. This is why it's like a mini kill. He's just going to stand there and die. Let's go for the headshot. Oh, black. MVP. Okay, so he's a dead guy. Let's just save our move. Yeah, okay, so just a quick note. I do this, I go for this guy, even though I want to hit this guy. Because often just works out that you'll hit the first guy. Nope. No one shot. Nope. Here it's not a good idea because we have the clear range. Maybe we can take. Uh, let's just kill him. Yeah, so as for a perk discussion, Terminator says that he prefers Steel Brow over Anticipation because the later Steel Brow requires a stat investment. Uh, I agree, but I will use Anticipation only on my backliners so they don't get attacked because that's how the AI works, right? So if they have high range defense, and the AI will just oh, not attack me. them. Instead, go for, for the frontliners. Uh, yeah, there's some, definitely something to be said about uh, going Steel Brow instead. Um, I find it. Hmm. Yeah, I would say yeah, it's both good and bad. I just find it a little bit better with the anticipation. Oh, it's up. Up here, too. Extra Chris says, and since anticipation gets worse, the closer you get, it's a bit of a waste. Yeah, but. No, but what I'm fearing is the crossbowmen, it's the master archer and so on. And they will always keep like four tiles distance, or at least most of the time. 
So very rare. like I don't take it for the javelins or the uh, X throwing axes like they're just bad and not really impactful so okay a couple of new armors I think I'll uh, no we can't go and sell okay so we have a battlefield maybe we can just walk up here see if I can see something Okay, so what I'm doing here, if we go to the mountain, we can just get a huge sight radio. So if there was something in this part of the forest, we can see it. We need to find something in the west and in the forest of this uh, Wormberg. Uh, I didn't see how many was that. There's uh, small footprint. So there's a small chance it could be this camp, but I have a feeling it's not because they sort of gave the impression that it was a uh, uh, breaking hideout or a certain okay so this is quite bad it's like third fourth time he only gets a free uh, yeah so in this case i went for the steel brow in the beginning because he had like no uh, guarantee of gaining any range defense. So that's also, I can say, when I determine do I go steel brow, do I do anticipation for the backline, do I do the steel brow if I know that the range defense is kind of dicey. A perfect level up for this guy, basically. Okay, so uh, I somehow messed up and had the follower notice, but for some reason it's not showing. I'll have to oh, test that. It did show on stream. Oh, it did show. Okay, so I'm yeah, just not got seeing. Cut off now. Got cut off. Um, Yeah, that's why I use a sound notification as well, so I can react the second it, it, go, it comes through. No. No, 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 no. <laughs> okay, this is like a death trap, at least this early. So basically, they also mean we need to watch out for lots of goblin patrols, but yeah, we kind of knew that from last time. Uh, okay, so we'll see. Yeah, I think um, if I say eat up, he's gonna be sad. So I'll just leave him be. But you might cure his his uh, Spartanism, right? Tell him to eat up. So uh, this camp we could do, but I still think we are looking for uh, like a raider camp. Maybe this guy. Okay, so this could be really. Uh, <laughs> this is a good uh, chance. This it's the right place. Like it's pretty much due west. It's in the forest. It could be raiders. It could also be shamans. So if I go in at shamans, I'll have to. Uh, uh, let's just uh, go to the hills, see if we can see a radar camp. If not, we'll attack this one. Okay. <laughs> I 
I have to die on the screen at some point, right? Yeah. <laughs> okay, so this fight I will take him in because it could be kind of difficult. And his defenses are not that great at the moment. Uh, let's just see, I'll burn the shield. And we want more maces. We want a uh, headpiece of some of our guys. Let's see. Yeah, I'm just uh, maxing out. Then we are close to the limit if we have a good fight here, so I'll just equip these dudes so they yeah, make more room. Yeah, and if you really want to go into it, we could put something in here. I think we should have enough space now. If I know any doggies left out of the battle, nope. And we have a couple of nets, as I remember, two nets. Hmm. Okay, so what I think this is, is uh, yeah, basically not the camp we're looking for. Uh, if we're unlucky, they have a necromancer, but um, he is likely to show up uh, down here in the beginning. It will be four of the Naxia, then a lot of the Vita gangers, possibly a fallen hero. The bad thing about the Naxia is that they can feast on on the corpses of the Vito gangers. Yeah. So we'll have to, like, sometimes here it's uh, worth not killing. So you basically just stand and wait and don't kill them if you can't step onto the corpse. So, a normal fight, I would take the choke points. Now I'll just leave this because I'm definitely gonna be stepping up at least one tile. And I'll leave the archers to try and take out the Naxias. So, let's just pass all the turns. And uh, most likely if they had... Yeah, so what also happens is they always wait one or two turns. Because then they get in the back. You'll have a hard time killing them and so on. Uh, let's try and see if we can soften him up. Can an artillery eat zombie flesh and feed them up with it? Yes, that's exactly. Oh. Okay, so uh, you could, it's really uh, like you might want to go for this guy now, but you actually don't. Like, you should just let him come close. I'm gonna have one more shot. This is gonna take forever. Basically, I think this is the fight I hate the most. Beater gangers in a forest. It's like, ah, come on. Let me move two tiles. Ah, this is our great sword arriving. <laughs> Just in time for our two hander guy down here. Nice. Oh, yeah. and he has no head armor. Mm, nom, nom, nom. Yeah, we only brought two flails and. Oh, let me see. Is this... This is like... Uh, um, I think it's 260 armor. 
either like yeah I don't think we can get the armor as well it's just too risky with the great sword uh, but basically I would like to move a few of the stunners north because we would like to stun lock him Yeah, we're not gonna kill unless they are close. Come on. Hmm. Maybe we can swap these. Maybe I can hit something one day. I'm not gonna... So he has iron lungs, he can easily recover all the fatigue here. So we don't want to kill this guy, we haven't seen the last few Anasias. Also interesting, if we have more fallen heroes, we might have a few. Um, yeah, they are approaching. So we can step on his corpse. We would actually like to kill this guy. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we want the guy to stun this, so we're just gonna stand and save fatigue. Yeah, if we're lucky he will go this way. Actually like him to go in the middle. couple of guys out here perfect we will go for this guy and we can kill no nope. so we can kill this guy he can jump in we can just kill him the next turn so that's fine but killing this guy, we don't. We don't want to kill this guy. I really like how the AI um, tries to basically bodyguard Nachtsailers, so you you can kill them as easily. They have a chance of feasting. So I actually think I'll. Um... I'm gonna let him run around. These guys are never gonna flee, so there's nothing to be scared of that we're not gonna get the greatsword unless, like, 
R&D foxes. Um, but I think I'll not kill this guy. I'm just gonna. He's probably just gonna run around for a bit. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Okay, so there's one we haven't seen. Um, yeah, he acts in two turns, so he can move here. Um, yeah, let's just wait. We can tank a hit if it's needed. There. So he could move in here. Then I just need. No, it's not the right time to kill, is it? Oh, yeah. See, this is annoying. But they're running away because this guy up here is probably gonna come around, try and eat something here. Flesh. Uh, not flesh. <laughs> More meat for the grinder. Yep. Yeah, let's just wait a bit. Okay, so now the fallen hero might go here. Can you hit the body? We'll just uh, let them come. Yeah, a perk that would give you the option to like give you a toggle ability that you can toggle in order to get um, only body shots. That would be amazing. Yep. That would be so good. Okay, so now I really like to kill this guy, free up. Uh, this uh, mace, so I can stun the, uh, say the boss. Um, maybe yeah, he's moving in. So, uh, as I remember, he can move one tile, and he will not be able to attack when he has the great sword. So basically, I have one round to set up my guys. Uh, probably a bad idea just to walk. Yeah, 22. Shit. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> What? <laughs> SOS dude says, me smash with great swords, me hit head when RNG says no, always go face, unless <laughs> RNG says no, chest has taunt me, still go face. Okay, so this guy, he will step out here, try and eat. We don't like that, but I don't think we can do much about it. Uh, boom, 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 what to do? I think this Naxia might get like really huge because it's gonna be difficult to avoid spreading the core.